Shortly after being released from the White Knight 2 master plane, Spaceship 2, exploded at an altitude of 15,200 meters, still far from the boundary of Earth's atmosphere. One of the two pilots was killed, while the others experienced a miracle and survived, and it was not the first accident of the 7 billion inhabitants of this planet, only about 530 have been in orbits outside the Earth, not all of them returned alive. Out of numbers is always an extreme risky affair, said Alan J. McDonald, a NASA expert who wrote the book Truth, Lies and O-Rings about the Challenger accident. Here are eight horror stories that have occurred in a trip to the sky, as quoted from Space.com. First Victim of Space Exploration The fatal accident that claimed the lives of humans the first time happened to Soviet Union cosmonauts, Vladimir Komarov. The Soyuz 1 capsule which brought it crashed into the ground in Russia in 1967. KGB intelligence sources at the time claimed that Komarov and a number of other people had sniffed the danger, but the Soviet leader ruled out the warning. Another version mentions, parachute failure is the cause of accidents. Sound recordings record the cosmonauts' final words for the control center. He shouted angrily at the engineers who were considered responsible for the accident. Blue Face 3 Russian Cosmonauts Another accident occurred in 1971. Three cosmonauts, Georgi Dobrovolsky, Viktor Patsayev, and Vladislav Volkov were killed on the way back to Earth from the Salyut 1 space station. The plane that took them, Soyuz 11 landed successfully as directed. However, the recovery team was shocked to find three men in it sitting dead, there were blackish blue spots on their faces. Meanwhile, blood flows from the ears and nose. The investigation revealed, their respiratory ventilation valve broke, cosmonauts experienced shortness of breath. Extreme pressure reduction also aggravates their condition. They died in seconds, which occurred at an altitude of 168 kilometers. In outer space, because the capsule brings all three back automatically, the satellite can land without being piloted. That was the first human death that occurred in space. Challenger Accident Only 73 seconds after taking off, on January 28, 1986, the Challenger exploded. Millions of US and world citizens who watch live broadcasts of the launch moments witness to the tragedy. No crew survived. Francis J. Scobie, Michael J. Smith, Judith A. Resnick, Ellison S. Onizuka, Ronald E. McNair, Gregory B. Jarvis, and Krista McAuliffe, died within minutes after they waved and said goodbye. The current President of the United States, Ronald Reagan delivered a special speech for the seven crew. He quoted a poem called High Flight or Flying High. The investigation revealed the O-ring seal was malfunctioning due to cold temperatures on the day of launch. The risks that NASA knows. The accident began a technical change as well as culture in the space agency and stopped the space shuttle program until 1988. Columbia Accident On February 1, 2003, another disaster occurred. The Columbia Space Shuttle, which contained seven crew, lost contact with the control station, just 16 minutes before landing on Earth. An accident is estimated to occur due to a piece of insulator material from the fuel tank that was released and hit the left wing of Columbia. Columbia was smashed to pieces just minutes before landing on Cape Canaveral. Five hours later, US President George W. Bush said the Columbia accident did not stop the space exploration effort. Seven crew members were killed in the incident, namely, Rick D. Husband, William C. M. C. Cool, Michael P. Anderson, Island Ramon, David Brown, Laurel Salton Clark, and Kalpana Chalway, the first female astronaut from India. Apollo 1 Firestorm The Apollo mission never killed astronauts while in outer space. However, two fatal accidents occur precisely on Earth. Three Apollo 1 astronauts, Gus Grissom, Edward White II, and Roger Chaffee were killed during the command module test on January 27, 1967. 
The fire burned the cockpit, strangling the breath of three astronauts, before burning their bodies. Investigations found a number of errors, including the use of pure oxygen in the cabin, flammable Velcro strips, and the physical structure of the aircraft that trapped the crew. Before the test was carried out, the three astronauts had time to share their anxiety about the cockpit, they took pictures in front of the airplane model with poses praying. The accident triggered many changes. Some people argue if the Apollo 1 accident did not occur, humans might never set foot on the moon. Apollo 13 Shortly after launch, Apollo 13 mission astronauts contacted the Mission Control Center, Houston, we have a problem Houston, we have a problem. The mission was launched on April 11, 1970, Apollo 13, from Kennedy Space Center, Florida. Two days later the oxygen tank exploded, the power became limited, the cabin temperature dropped, lack of water. The moon landing mission was foiled. However, the Apollo program owed the Apollo 13 mission to a swift, deft action that prevented another disaster. Fortunately again the entire crew survived and managed to land on Earth on April 17, 1970. Lightning and Wolves Although it did not result in fatalities, NASA's space program and the Soviet Union had been troubled by lightning and wolves. In 1969, lightning struck the same spacecraft, lightning struck the Apollo 12 on 36 and 52 seconds after taking off, fortunately after that the mission went smoothly. While Alexei Leonov and Pavel Belyev, Soviet Union cosmonauts experienced unique events. On March 18, 1965 Alexei Leonov succeeded in becoming the first human to walk in outer space or extravehicular activity, EVA, because he experienced air leaks and a number of rigid materials, he hurriedly re-entered the capsule. An effort that is laborious, because he has to reduce the pressure of his outerwear and the risk of scrambling in with his partner in the capsule. When the aircraft made it back to Earth, the Foscode plane escaped the landing target and was trapped in the middle of the forest in the Ural Mountains. Both of them were forced to wait for the rescue team amid the howls of hungry wolves. Thank you for watching this video, please like if you like this video and comment if you don't like it and don't forget to subscribe to this channel so you can continue to grow and provide other information, thank you and see you again.